What's going on, my lovers? My name is Marlevin Landry. So I'm not even going to lie. I'm a little frustrated. Last night, I spent a lot of time shooting this really, really good game. And I put a lot of good edits and everything into it. I was very excited to release it today. However, the music in the video from the game had a, a huge copyright claim on it. And I'd have to mute the whole video to get it up on YouTube. So I had to scrap it. But that's okay. That's just part of being a YouTuber. However, I didn't want to leave you guys empty handed. So I'm going to put a video out here right now for you guys. This is going to be called Into the Woods. I really appreciate it. If you slap that like button, be sure you click that mother and subscribe button as well if you're enjoying super spooky season. Let's go ahead and get into it, shall we? Into the woods. Looks like we're straight into it. Oh. Oh, oh. So we're playing as a little kid. Harry Potter. Harry Potter. I, I believe so. So this is like a really short, uh, five, ten minute indie horror game. Uh, don't really know what it's really about. But we're playing as a child, obviously, and we'll see what happens. Okay, out we go. Out we go. I like the fixed camera angles. You know me. Huge fan of it. Just like Resident Evil. Seems like more games are doing this, too. A lot of games are going back to this kind of um, old school style, if you will. There's no need to enter this door right now. I just want to know what the door is. Is my mom and dad out here trying to beat my ass if they find me? I don't know. There's no need to enter this door right now. Okay. Okay. What about this one? Okay. Okay. They all seem to be the same. Nothing of importance. Down the stairs we go. Down the stairs we go. Be careful now. Don't you go tripping. Don't you go tripping. Okay. We're here. Like I said, I really don't know what this is <laughs> even about. But it looked cool why I kind of downloaded it uh, can't enter outside we go I guess outside we go I don't know why we're going outside but we're here oh geez there's a shovel very Resident Evil rusty shovel yes okay so we got an inventory hold on do we have a no we can't see our character Hey, Rusty Shovel, why on earth would I need that? I could never know. The old car is taking up the entire driveway. Are we hopping on the bike? We are. Yo, I love games like this, by the way. Let me know down below in the comments. Are you a fan of these games? Because I will keep playing them. And off we go, I guess. Where the hell are we? It's better, better to just not know, I guess. Are we standing in the middle of the road? Okay, no. What is this? What is this thing? You haven't seen anybody drive past you for at least five hours. Five hours? What have we been doing the whole time? Five hours? Still is probably a good idea to keep off the road for safety. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that would be a smart idea. Man, this game, like, it surprisingly looks very well, uh, by the way. Very well. Looks very good. <laughs> Still don't know why we need a shovel, what any of this is really about. I assume we go into this dark alleyway, right? Okay. I'm sure nothing spooky is going to happen. Very, very spooky. I'm sure. I'm sure of it. Into the woods! Just like the game says. Into the very dark, spooky woods of happiness, right? Oh. 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 Okay. Why am I seeing a red glow? Are we in hell itself? Yeah, I swear if this is like Pet Cemetery, we're gonna go dig up a, a dead cat or something. It ain't gonna be cool. Okay. The ground suddenly gives way to reveal an expanse. A forested valley far, far below. Are you sure this kid knows these words? In the distance, the black outline of a huge gnarled tree is silhouetted against the burning orange sunrise. Yeah, you know, it kind of looks like um, Dark Souls a little bit. Just me? I don't know. <laughs> Back into the woods, okay. All right. 
Why not? Why not? Why freaking not? Yo, I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. Little nervous. A little. I swear, this is Pet Cemetery. This is Pet Cemetery, isn't it? A mound of old compacted earth. Juts? Is that that word? Juts from the ground like some kind of strange tumor. An ancient decayed shovel has been stabbed into the top. What is this place? This is Pet Cemetery, isn't it? A lot of bodies. A lot of bodies. Which one? Which one do I want? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Follow the path. And this is where hell breaks loose. I'm sure of it. I'm sure of it. Use it because why not? Why not? What am I digging up? What are you... Oh. Oh, what? Is that my grave? Oh, God. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yo, did someone kill me? I think someone just hit me in the back of the head and then buried me. This is terrible. I'm just a little boy. I'm just a little boy. Into the woods. What? A short glimpse into a strange occurrence developed by leaky fingers. Well, that's that then. Let me give me my. Let me give you my thoughts on the game. I I, I enjoyed it. I like the the Resident Evil aspect with the fixed camera angles, the item management. I wish there were a couple more things you could pick up, uh, considering we had all of that inventory management to deal with. However, uh, this was pretty good for what it was. Keep up the good work for whoever developed this. This was. Uh, I, I liked it. I liked it. I I, I wish I kind of knew who hit me in the back of the head and buried me alive. I don't know. But it was spooky. I like it really gave me pet cemetery vibes, which uh, I, I like that. I like that. Like I said, if you enjoyed this video, show your support. Leave a like. Type a comment down below, please. I love to read the comments. And if you want to stay up to date with more super spooky season, make sure you click that my love and subscribe button so you can stay up to date. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you, my lovers, in the next video.